in this edition of State of War Gujarat, we're going to put the spotlight on the tribal vote in the hotly contested battleground of Gujarat. How important is the important is the vote of the Gujarat tribals? We're going to break it down for us in terms of population, in terms of uh, political affinity. Where does the tribal vote stand? Because when you look at the state of Gujarat. Uh, Comparatively to other states in the country, Gujarat has a huge, sizable uh, population when it comes down to the ST vote. It stands at 15%. Scheduled tribes population stands at 15%. Thereby, in the 182-seat scenario, 27 seats are reserved for STs, scheduled tribes. That's a sizable chunk. Now... In the district with tribal population across the various districts of Gujarat, 14 districts have a sizable population of tribals that can swing the vote or impact the vote for sure. Now in these 27 seats viewers, if you're going to break it down, let's break it down. In the first phase, first phase is on the 1st of December, second phase on the 5th of December. On the 1st of December, 14 of the 27 seats are going to polls which are reserved ST seats, scheduled tribe seats, 14 of them. In the second phase, which is on December 5th, 13, 13 of uh, the reserved seats would be going to polls. Now, all tribal seats in the first phase of elections, which is the 14 seats in the first phase of elections, are from the south of Gujarat. All of them, all 14 are from the south of Gujarat. Well, this is what it stands uh, in terms of... Uh, what it looks like in terms of the tribal belt. But let's now go back to what the results of both uh, these uh, 14 seats and 13 seats that are going to go to polls uh, on the 1st and the 5th of December. 2017 viewers, these 14 seats which are going to polls on the 1st of December, only 5 were won by the BJP. Congress won 7, the BTB won 2. The South was swept by the BJP but not the tribal seats. And this figure stands testimony to that. Let's look at the 13 seats that will be polling on the 5th of December. What was the fate of these 13 seats in 2017? Well, out of which Congress swept 8, Bharati Janta Party at 4, and an independent just one. So clearly, till 2017 viewers. And, you know, we're going to delve a little deeper in that, that despite uh, 25 years out of power, the Congress has always been able to hold on uh, to the tribal seats uh, or... Uh, has a strong base where the tribal seats are concerned in the state of Gujarat. So this is what it looks like uh, before we delve into what is the plan of the Bharatiya Janata Party, what is the plan of the Aam Aadmi Party, of the Congress and all of this. I want to cut across to our reporters and our guests this evening, Gopi Manyar, my colleague uh, who's tracked Gujarat very, very closely for many years, uh, also tracked the 2017 election, is joining us, so is Saurabh Bhaktanya. Both of them come to us from Ahmedabad. I want to cut across to Gopi first. We also have our consulting editor, Rajdeep Sardesai, in the studio. But Gopi, quickly coming down to you. 2017, Gopi, if you look at it, now it's been 25 years, but at that time, 20 years ago, the Congress was the base. The vote in tribal vote, the vote in tribal areas, was quite strong. In 2017, the Congress was also very big. So there is a base of Congress, which is very solid, which is the tribal belt. Do you think that this time, भाजपा डेंट कर पाएगी क्या बिल्कुल देखिए प्रीति जिस तरीके से भाजपा लगातार पिछले पांच साल में अगर ट्राइबल लीडर्स की बात की जाए तो भाजपा ने कम से कम छह से सात कांग्रेस के जो ट्राइबल लीडर्स हैं उनको कहीं ना कहीं जो लीडर्स हैं उनका तोड़ा है ये हम कह सकते हैं क्योंकि जो एमएलएस थे वो एमएलएस ने इन पांच साल में छह से सात जितने ट्राइबल विधायक थे जो कांग्रेस को छोड़ चुके हैं आ, सवाल यहाँ पे ये आता है कि आ, और छोड़ने के बाद कई लीडर्स ऐसे हैं जो बीजेपी ज्वाइन कर चुके हैं अब आ, ये भी एक बात है कि अगर आप नया जो मंत्रिमंडल बना यानी भूपेंद्र पटेल के मंत्रिमंडल को देखेंगे तो करीब पांच ट्राइबल लीडर्स को मिनिस्टर बनाया गया है तो बीजेपी का जो पूरा का पूरा फोकस है वो ट्राइबल लीडर्स पर है और बीजेपी लगातार ये कोशिश कर रही है क्योंकि देखिये दो का जो चुनाव था जिसने हिंदुत्व का एक मुद्दा छाया हुआ था उस वक्त भी बीजेपी 127 सीट जीत पाई थी और तब भी जो ट्राइबल सीट्स है 
वो लगातार कांग्रेस के पास बनी हुई थी और उसके बाद जो रेशियो था जो नंबर ऑफ सीट है वो लगातार डाउन होती जा रही थी लेकिन दो में भी आ, काफी ज्यादा क्योंकि कांग्रेस का जो मैक्सिमम परफॉर्मेंस था वो 78 एट सीट था कांग्रेस का 2002 के बाद हमने देखा आ, लेकिन बीजेपी जो है वो अपने 150 फिफ्टी प्लस के टारगेट को छूना चाहती है इस बार अगर 150 फिफ्टी प्लस के टारगेट को उनको छूना है तो ये ऐसी सीट है जो ट्राइबल सीट है अगर वो ट्राइबल सीट पे बैन नहीं कर पाई तो बीजेपी वन प्लस का जो उनका टारगेट है उसे कभी नहीं छू पाएगी इसीलिए लगातार कोशिश की जा रही है प्रधानमंत्री भी देखिए आप ट्राइबल एरिया में प्रधानमंत्री भी रैलियां कर रहे हैं और लगातार यह जताने की कोशिश कर रहे हैं कि जो रैली हो रही है और जो ट्राइबल्स के लिए डेवलपमेंट हुआ है वो उनकी सरकार में सबसे ज्यादा और सबसे बेहतरीन हुआ है ये भी एक जताने की कोशिश की जा रही है प्रीति